Hey everybody, what is going on? Do we have any Bob's Burgers fans? Because I love that show. My monitor has been having some issues just turning off for no reason, so I decided to upgrade. And the big question was, do I want to go for 240 hertz or do I want to stick with a 144 hertz? I decided that today I'm gonna try to get a 240 hertz monitor to see how it is. This is what I decided to go for, 240 hertz monitor from ASUS. This is not a sponsored video. I paid for this every single penny, $559 on Amazon, but it came with free shipping, so <laughs> basically pays for itself. On the box right here it says, play like a pro, expect me to get global elite by tonight. This is a foam case that all of it has to come out. I can't just take out the top of it and remove the monitor. Well, here is the monitor. A little thick on the back side. Something that I didn't think about. Can I mount this on the monitor stand? Okay, so this thing comes out. There's a few screws that I need to take out, but I'm pretty sure I can mount it. Let's just see what else came in here. Power cable into the power brick, HDMI cable, display port, USB 3.0 cable. This is gonna be the base for the monitor that pretty much goes right here. The cover that goes on the back of the monitor. Glass pads and this. Not sure where those go. Normally, you don't wanna use a drill for this, but this is a very low in power drill. There we go. Now I have four holes to which I should be able to put it on my mount. I'm gonna go hook up the monitor and that concludes our unboxing. Question number one that I'm probably gonna get is, do I see a difference? Obviously, it's a little hard to explain it over the internet, but let me give it a try. What you are seeing right now is 60 Hertz. You can see that as I'm moving around, it just, there's a little bit of glitchiness happening. It's not as smooth. On 144 Hertz, you should be able to see the difference that it's a lot smoother. The images are getting stitched together in a way better manner. Finally, on two 240 hertz you would expect it to be double as good but playing it back it's not what you would expect the difference between the 144 hertz and 240 hertz monitor despite them being the same size is more than double between 60 hertz and 144 hertz it's like day and night it is a huge and very noticeable difference the big question is it worth the 301 dollar difference between the 144 hertz and 240 hertz i'll be honest with you guys first impressions yes you do see a little bit of a difference but when you look at the bank is that difference worth $300 over the next couple of weeks I'm gonna keep on gaming and see if it's actually worth the difference luckily I got it from Amazon so if I don't like it I'm gonna return it and maybe go for a bigger monitor in size or maybe go for a monitor that's 2k or 4k let me know what you guys think about this video if you guys can tell the difference or not tell it so much if you have a 240 Hertz monitor and you came from 144 let me know if you saw the difference and other than that I hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you guys see me unboxing a different monitor in the next couple of weeks that means i didn't keep this one other than that i'll see you guys on the live stream